Welcome to Japarity. Our contestants are Grace, Eden, and Drew. Grace, you're up first. What category would you like? Food for 1,000 to the 10th power, please. Okay. True or false? Tea bags were named tea bombs during World War One. True. Correct. What category would you like next? Food for 200, please. What kinds of food did the British soldiers in the trenches eat? Cupcakes! Incorrect. They ate bread, jam, cheese, and fresh vegetables. Eden, you're up next. What category would you like? Discovery and Inventions for 400. Who was the Indian woman who went with Lewis and Clark to explore Louisiana territory? Sacagawea. Correct. What category would you like? Walls for 600. Who built the Great Wall of China? Donald Trump. Incorrect. Drew, you're up next. I would like discoveries and inventions for 200. What was one of the main inventions of the 1860s that aided in Western expansion? The Transcontinental Railroad. Correct. What category would you like? I would like uh, Manifest Destiny for 600. When did the term Manifest Destiny originate? Uh, the 1960s. Incorrect. It was the 1840s. And now we're leaving for a commercial break. Are you tired of coughing? Are you tired of sneezing from allergies? Are you tired of muscle soreness in your joints? Well, what you need is our 100% totally pure mercury. With our formula of 100% totally pure mercury, we can guarantee that it will cure any ailment. Just listen to some of our customer feedback. You should buy some. It's amazing. I do say that uh, you should try this. It, it would be good. Be great for you. Man, this looks like it would cure everything. I'm down. Where can I buy this? 100% totally pure mercury. Found at a store in the 1800s. 100% total pure mercury is now responsible for death by heavy metal poisoning, blood loss, asphyxiation, digestion, death by fire, mixtape, amputation, decapitation, death by roasting, projectiles, long storage, robot ninjas, pennies from the Empire State Building, starvation, dehydration, poisonous frogs, snake venom, piano from the sky, toggle, revenge, plants, crocodiles, death by death. Some assembly required batteries not included. And it's what you need. It's what you want. It's what you get. And we're back from our commercial break. Welcome to Japarity. So you're up next. What category would you like? Food oh, for 400, please. When did you get it? In what year oh, was Coca-Cola first on sale in Britain? 2015. Incorrect. It was first on sale in 1900. Eden, what category would you like? Discovery and inventions, please. For, is, for 600. What is Thomas Edison's invention? The light bulb. Correct. Eden, what category would you like? Discovery and inventions for 800. Who discovered America and when? Um, what is it? Columbus sailed the ocean blue in like 2002. Incorrect. Co Christopher Columbus sailed the ocean blue in 1492. It's close enough. Drew, what category would you like? I'll do uh, War of Jenkins uh, year for 200. In this year, England declared what is known as the War of Jenkins year on Spain. Um, 1692? Incorrect. The answer is 1739. And now we have a commercial break. Hey everybody, I'm Carla. And I'm Chris. And, and together, together, we're the Crazy Cooks. What are we going to be talking about this episode, Carla? Today, we'll be talking about the excellent small cakes. They're pretty excellent, and they're pretty small. What's in these cakes or cookies, Carla? We use the finest butter and rose bushes. Rose bushes, you said. Yep. I don't think they put rose bushes in cookies. Maybe maybe you meant rose water? I'm pretty sure it was rose bushes. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure it wasn't, because wouldn't it be all prickly? Ah. Hmm. So it was rose water, not rose bushes. Don't listen to Carla, guys. She has no idea what she's talking about. But our second type of cookies, we have, they're pretty great, we have cookies and Christmas cookies. No. I know this, and they're not Christmas cookies. They are Christmas cookies. No, they're Christmas. Look, it says right down the label. See, I'll show you. It says cookies and Christmas cookies. Christmas cookies. You're right, Carla. I'm sorry. 
Why don't you tell us about these Christmas cookies? So these Christmas cookies. See, now you're making me say it. I'm sorry. These Carla. Christmas cookies. They were transported on the railroads back in the 1700s to the United States. And that's how they became to be eaten by the peoples. And that's how we were able to eat them. Okay. And where can we find these? Can I buy them anywhere? Because I really want to taste them. You could buy them at your local grocery store for three bucks a cookie. Three bucks a cookie? Yes. Okay. Well, I guess I'll go buy one after this. They better be pretty good. They are really good. Okay, that's great. Now, these next ones, they are called Anzac Biscuits, and even though they say biscuits, they're cookies, I promise. And these Anzac Biscuits, can you show them what the Anzac Biscuits are? These are the Anzac Biscuits. Mm -hmm. These Anzac Biscuits were made in Scotland and eaten by the Scotlanders. This, you mean the Scottish? Yes. Well, they were eaten by the people in Scotland, and then they brought them over here on boats. But... We just ran out of these Anzac cookies yesterday, so if you would like some, you're going to have to go back to Scotland and ask for some. Too bad. Yeah. Well, and then there's this other kind of cookies. This one is one of my favorite kinds ever. They're called animal cookies, but they're better yeah. known as... Animal cookies! Oh, oh wait. Carla, Car you were supposed to say animal crackers. Animal crackers. That's right, Carla. They are animal crackers. And how many different types types of animals are there in animal crackers? There are 37 different types of animals in each box. And it must have been a really zoo in there. A zoo? Yeah. I bet. I mean, 30, that's a lot of animals. I mean, it must have been a zoo. You're right, Carla. Mm-hmm. And I can find these. You can find these all over the place. They're also going to be at your local grocery store. But they're a bit cheaper than those Christmas cookies. You can Don't buy, get us wrong, they're still really good. They are, they're amazing. You can buy all 37 of these animals for one dollar. And then, there, <laughs> Carla, why don't you tell us about your favorite type of cookie? My favorite type of cookie are the chocolate chip cookies. Where'd you, you get definitely the, wait, wait, hold cookies. on, Carla, where'd you get the cookie? Did you, did you open the bag? They're my couch cookies. Okay, well, keep talking about those amazing chocolate chip cookies, Carla. So, these amazing chocolate chip cookies were made by Ruth Winfield mm -hmm. in the 1900s. No? And... How much are they? Because these are actually really they're good. They're just delicious. I think they're 25 cents a piece. Per cookie? Because I make them. Okay, everybody come to Carla's house. She will give you free cookie. Well, not free. 25 cents for a cookie. Everybody, I'll give you her address. It'll be in the comments of the ah! episode. <laughs> Okay. Well, it'll it'll be in the comments of this episode. But I think that about wraps it up for this week. Next week, come back and we're going to be talking about making marshmallow towers. Yeah! Yeah! This has been the Crazy Cooks. These are really good. Welcome back to Japan. Food for 600, please. What did the people of the Wild West eat? Uh, they ate turkey and fish. Correct. What category would you like? Food for 800, please. What food is California and Hawaii known for? Mexican food. Incorrect. They were known for fruit. Eden, what category would you like? Um, new government for 400. What were the ten First Amendments called? Mine come. Incorrect. They were called the Bill of Rights. Drew, what category? Uh, walls for 800. How many people escaped by going under and over the Berlin Wall? Uh, yeah, over 5,000 Mexicans. Incorrect. It was 5,000 Germans. And we have another commercial break from one of our sponsors. The date is July 28th, 1914. The world is at war. What you need is a shovel. Five ninety nine. <laughs> Why do you want these shovels? So you can dig deep trenches from the enemy. Hide it with your flat shovel, with your long shovel, and with all other shovel needs. All your shovel needs. Looking for some gardening shovels? You need something short? And something short as well? These are great for your gardening needs. You can get carrots, potatoes, what other you need out there. All for five ninety nine. dollars limited time only. All your shovel needs. 
Shovels, just five ninety nine. Found at a store in nineteen fourteen. Shovels incorporated is not liable for any death or damage done by shovels, including but not limited to decapitation, amputation, tetanus, blood loss, cancer, suffocation, heart failure, lung damage, loss of limb, EDM seizures, death by sick beats, fire escapes, conservation, or death by death. Buy one, get two extra is only for country contributing retailers to feel like giving you the small shovel. Batteries not included, lots of assembly required. We're back from the commercial break. Grace, what category would you like? Walls for 200, please. How long is the Wall of China? to all of you watching there have been some recent break-ins at your local homes and offices if you have any disturbances please call us at 111 thank you you're watching yellow page news bringing you coverage on all the latest stories telling you exactly what we want you to know we have received word of a shooting in Boston. If you live in the Boston area, please stay indoors as the local redcoats are going insane. Thank you. We have Katie live on the scene, bringing you live coverage as live as it gets. Thanks, Morgan. So, why are you protesting against the British government? The government's not represent representing us in Parliament. No taxation without representation. Thank you, sir. Back to you, Morgan. Do you want to do that? Do you want to do that? Well, so I, don't break it. I need to be in the shot. Oh, I even put I numbers beside it. Oh. I'm still recording. Why didn't you? <laughs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Twenty-four. Oh, I'm 20. I am too. I'm sticky. Oh, I feel disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Whoa! <laughs> you see my double whip? <laughs> okay, who stopped? Yeah, that'll be in the, uh, in the kitchen. Battery's almost dead. I'm rather, actually, I'm gonna flash. <laughs> I gotta have, like, the, like, like the loud. Done. Okay. That's a wrap. I'm not dead yet! No self-serve. <laughs>